with 13 members in the troop, the North Carolina Zoo is proud to be the home of the largest group of chimpanzees in American zoos. And one of those chimps has a very unique story. Kendall is a 10-year-old male who came to the zoo in 2006 after an early life in the entertainment industry. Now the long-term problems faced by primates raised for entertainment and advertising has become the focus of an educational website developed by the zoo's chimpanzee staff. Kendall was in the entertainment industry. He had been used for movies and for television and also for a live stage show. And he got to be the age of six and started challenging his trainers. That's a normal behavior for chimps. Once they reach puberty and their hormones start to change, they challenge those around them. So he needed a home. Most chimps that have been used in the entertainment industry have been pulled as infants from their mothers. So they don't develop appropriate social skills to live comfortably with those of their own species. The primary goal of the Kendall Project is to raise awareness about chimps and other great apes in the entertainment industry. Most people see them on television and in movies and don't realize what happens to those animals once they reach a certain age that they can't be used any longer. Kendall has made a lot of improvements since he got here. He's currently living with one male and three adult females, so that's taken almost two years. And that's just because he has to learn the basic fundamentals that a young chimp raised by chimps would have already known. Judging by his improvements so far, we have every reason to think that he'll be part of our group as a whole. Keepers hope that Kendall's story will help educate the public about the plight of primates in entertainment. If you'd like to learn more, please visit their website at kendallproject.org. I'm Rod Hackney reporting for the Zoo Files, connecting your life to wildlife.